gosh, I hit them bitches in my sock glue. What's good with you guys? Sorry for the lack of uploads. You know, your boy, I've been putting in work and I got, you know, things going on. So I'm just trying to get ready for this great content I'm trying to expose into my. You heard that? Computer tweaking. Him! Expose him! <laughs> Mind that I just got some stuff I need to implement into my videos. I'm trying to make it look a little bit spiffier for you guys. So equipment on the way, you know, moves on the way. If you want to keep updated, I'm gonna just tell you that my Instagram and Twitter will be linked down in the description. So you might as well follow it. Okay, into the video. So Houston Rock has been on the high end. I'm just telling you that straight up. I know that they're gonna win the championship. It, it's, it's that simple. What other team is beating them? I'll wait. You, you can't you can't say nothing else because it, Houston Rockets, they're hands down, man's down, the best team in the NBA right now. And if you were to say they're not, you'd just be lying to them, so yourself because Golden State Warriors are really having a little bit of trouble with the Houston. Um, let me let me pull up my phone right quick. You know what I'm saying? I gotta check up the stats because I believe Houston Rockets in the up and rising. They're on a 15 game win streak, and this is crazy from a team that nobody even cared about. Chris Paul, he's been putting in work. He's making the Houston Rockets a little bit more diversified. Looking at the stats, the Houston Rockets actually have the second best defense, defense offensively in the NBA, which is crazy. Since they have James Harden, he's one of the best players in the NBA, but defensive wise. He's a clown. He's a laughing suck for defensive efficiency. He's just not that consistent at the defensive end. But the offense, that's a different story. He's a 10 out of offense, negative 2 from defense. What can you say from James Harden? He's a lopsided player, but I guess his offense is so great that it covers all the defense. But Chris Paul, he does play hand and the defense. Chris Paul, he may be only six foot, which is not that tall, but he do have the ability to strip players. He knows how to read the defense. He knows how to stop passes, and he knows how to guide the players. So I'm thinking Chris Paul's the reason why the Houston Rockets defense is a little bit better because he's more of a smart player. His basketball IQ is phenomenal. If you're looking at the stats, we can see how the Houston Rockets been taking a little bit more free those than usual they're driving into the paint a little bit more we can see their jump shot and mid-range shot is actually improving we see an increase and also the three-point shot we can see that the Houston Rockets is considered a Golden, Golden State Warriors type of team because they are very efficient behind the line and they're very efficient from three-point and from mid-range they're good with the jumpers but the thing that I would say that Houston Rockets have the upper hand is getting fouls while driving into the paint we can see that James Harden he's, he's basically like a god at that move he's just able to go into the paint and get fouled and cause a three-point play and put his team up one or two points regardless of the score Golden State Warriors on the other hand they're not really a driving type of team we will get KD occasionally Stephen Curry he usually don't go in the paint other than that maybe Draymond but other than that we really wouldn't see anybody really driving into the paint like much other teams even though the Golden State Warriors really do have length in their team they have a lot of top players they have a 6'7 shooting guard, a 7 foot small forward. This is it's really crazy how tall these players are, but they really don't use their ability to their advantage. So we'll just have to wait and see. And if Golden State Warriors beat Houston Rockets, because I know they're going to make it to the finals, they're going to make it to the playoffs, the finals, I don't know if they're going to make it to the finals, because I feel like, you, you feel me, Golden State going to have to get eliminated from Houston so he can go against the Eastern Conference. But hey, if it comes to that, it comes to that. All you Golden State Warriors fan, leave a comment down below. Tell me why I'm wrong. I want to know your opinion of the reason why the statements and accusation I'm making is completely wrong and that Houston Rockets will get obliterated. Let me know in the comment section down below say something good like say something worthy of me screenshotting so i can post it in the beginning of my videos because recently y'all not engaged and I'm, I'm not feeling that i need some more subscribers so smash that like button Fuckers, I could make you rich. I could make you rich.